In this video, I will show you how to design a stairway that would look something like this. Um, three foot one landings. The Remember the stair building code, most of them for residential stairs is three foot. You might want to go a little longer. 10 inch treads. 36 inches is the minimum for the um, width of the stairs. So we can make them 37 inches. That might help us out, especially when we drywall something. Just throwing it out there. And in case you're trying to figure out just how in the heck this works, let's go ahead and take a look at it here. So we're going to go up three steps, landing, three steps, landing, three steps, landing, three steps, and then the second floor. So no mystery there. The uh, miracle has been solved there if you're wondering where in the heck it's going to start and where it's going to stop. So when you look at that on a floor plan, sometimes it's going to be confusing, but the architect would probably draw a start and a end line in there, something to give you an idea, or at least an elevation, something that would help with the um, solve the mystery there. So again, three steps up, another three steps to the landing, and I believe this set of stairs has 16 risers. So if you don't need, if that's going to be too many risers for you, I have a solution for that in the next example. Again, the headroom is going to be here. You're going to get the headroom. Let's go back. You're going to get the headroom in here from um, cantilever in the joist or maybe even putting a post here or a post here with a with a support beam something like that so not a problem to uh, build something like this with a cantilever or with a post and uh, beam type of system and some joist hangers and in this example i just went ahead and removed one step so this is going to give us 15 risers Let's go ahead and count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. So two steps and the rest have three steps. A view from above. I'm not going to have a problem here with the headroom. What it would look like on the floor plan. Now let's go ahead and remove another step. Um, so again, the stairway is probably going to be starting right here, going up. And this one here, of course, would have 14 risers. And that might be more of a beneficial stairway for a um, set of stairs that would be used in a building with 2 by 12 floor joist, um, 3 quarter inch floor sheathing, and an 8 foot ceiling. So 2, 3, 2, and then 3. Not that complicated. And again, you can see here, if I needed to get rid of another step, um, I could take one out of here. I could take another one out of here to have two steps, two steps, all the way up. Two steps up, two steps, two steps, and two steps if that's what I wanted instead of two, three, two, and three. And this is about wrapping up the video. So if you uh, find these videos helpful, and uh, they somehow inspire you to build a set of stairs like this. Um, I would love to see a picture of your stairway. You can always email me a picture and you can get our email address at the website. And if you like the, like the video, um, don't forget to hit the old thumbs up button and let us know.